Hello everybody, my name is Lunar Owl and welcome back to Riftbreaker. Last video we did the preparations for the end fight, but I said I was gonna I was gonna activate the portal, but now I wanna actually just, you know, finish prepping the base entirely, because we still have some work to do actually. Like we have more artillery towers to put up and basically just essentially just prepping for everything, just to make sure my base is alien proof essentially remove these two. Yeah. Alright. So what I want to start with is something that I've wanted to do since the last video and to extend this part. Let's start with the floor tiles because that's usually the annoying thing to do and it takes up the most amount of time. What? Come again? I can place these and these, but... Is this game bugged? Screw it, I'm placing these, it's fine. Um, does I just want the base to look uniform and nice. There we go, alright. Because I'm not, I'm not in the mood to struggle. Not now, not ever. Anyway. There we go. Nice and simple. Bye bye tree. Let's start with removing these. There we go. Remove that, remove that, remove this. Alright. I can remove that as well. I can this, uh, this, 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 and this. This. That one can stay. That's fine. That one can stay. This one's gonna go. Alright. So, what I wanna do is this. This. There we go. Just like this. 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 And this. Oh yeah. Before I forget. This nice little skin you're seeing. Right when I was editing the last video. The update dropped for the Lunar New Year event. Now look at this guys. I want to show you guys this. Settings. Seasonal events. On. Look at this. You guys are going to love this. Look at this. Everything's nice and, and red. Just really freaking cool. It's only these tiles, these tiles are the same, which kind of fucking sucks, but, you know, I actually like it. It's really nice. Let's see. Here, we can put one. What about that? Yeah, alright, let's try this. Let's do the usual... Minefield setup. There we go. Now what we can do is basically this, this. An is near our base. To defend our base. Oh, this is where this is gonna come in handy. I am excited. I want to see how good the actual defenses are gonna be. But I have no doubt in my mind, they're going to be amazing. Also, these things make a weird sound when they open. I don't know why. There we go. Alright, so... Place one here, one here, one here, one here, one here, and one here. I'm not going to be placing shield generators all over this place. That's just going to be too much work. and I'm not in the mood for that. Honestly. What, show, what sort of things? Lightning spike. Nah, I can't upgrade them. That sucks. Let's see. Where are my asset towers? Yeah, corrosive towers. There. There. These nuke towers are gonna come in handy. There we go. Swarm rocket towers. There we go. Where's the corrosive artillery? Yeah, they're gonna be 
so fucking good right here. Um, let's see. There, there, there. Whoops. Smack my keyboard, my mouse. There we go. Now that looks nice and uniform. It looks really good. Whoops. There we go. Alright. That's done and dust then. Are the mine layer towers actually gonna lay their mines or are they just gonna be broken? Oh no, wait. There. Wonderful. Wonderful. Look how satisfying that is. Nice. Let's see how good these towers actually are. We're gonna see them firsthand. For now, I just wanna put this here before I actually end up forgetting. There we go. These are gonna be the big guys that come to attack. Oh my lord, look at that. These are just the minigun towers. Holy shit. Heavy artillery towers are fucking things up, my dude. Nothing's getting through my base. Oh, a few coming down here. Seems like they're handling themselves pretty well. Yep. They aren't even coming close to me. My god, look at that. <laughs> that is something beautiful. Fuck yeah. Look at that, dude. They're not even coming close. These are the best towers in the game by fucking far. Hell yeah. Just look at that. Hell yeah, dude. Oh, okay. These these actually need a good line of sight, so I might actually need to move them. There we go. So the nuke towers are gonna have to be moved. Unfortunately. Fuck. That's a problem for later. So basically what I want to do now is I want to move this little cable, or cable, this little pipe down a bit. Let's move it down here, down here, down here. And then we can basically put it here. That means in layman's terms we can put in put one here, one here. I'll just up the plasma converters because we're making more than enough right now. More than enough supercharged plasma. So, let's see. Put here. We can put another one here. Another one here. And then basically we can put this here. About there. Yeah. How many can we put down? Let's see. Each of them takes 25, so we could put about 8 more, I think, if my math is correct. Maybe even more, which is even better. I want to put two of them... Where the fuck is it? Put one here, and another normal one here. Yeah. Put one here. Put one here, and then one smack dab in the middle. Yeah. Oh lord. That is nuts. Yeah. At the end of this video I'm gonna dismantle all of this in preparation for the main fight. Which is gonna be so good. Even the Sentinel Towers look different. Prepare for so cool. storm. <clears throat> Wonder <clears throat> <clears throat> Excuse me. Wonderful. Sorry, that was weird. Let's put some... Oh, that's fun. 
We have to wait until the storm passes. You think so, Mr. Riggs? There we go. And there we go. I know those eat up iron. I really don't care. Ice laser. We can put some of these here, actually, to see how they will fare. And then... A plasma mortar. That's gonna be pretty cool. Yeah. Yeah. I know these cables aren't the neatest, or these pipes aren't the neatest, but, you know, at this point I really don't care. <laughs> Let's see. Go up here. And put them here. Put them down a bit. Here. Now we can put some here as well. Actually, before we continue to this, let's up the plasma converter count to. Let's add four more, right? Let's add four more plasma converters. Thank you, Riggs. One, two, three, four. Yeah, that should be good. Do that. We can do this. Do this. Yeah. That should be pretty good. Yeah. That means we can add even more. Now, well, that's building. Not enough ammunition to operate defensive towers. Come again. Am I missing something? What? Oh, we're not outputting enough supercharged plasma. Oh, they're still building. They're still building. All right. Almost done. There we go. There we go. Now the input should be just enough. Imagine. Imagine. Guess we're gonna have to put on a few more. Let's see. One, two, three. One, two, three. Yeah. That's be pretty good. It's because I don't have them on a buffer, which is fine to me. There we go. Now we should have more than enough when those are done building. Because in case you guys were wondering, we're only eating about 1,600 per second out of the actual input that is 8,000 from these bad boys. Hell yeah. This is still balanced. Yep. Now, I'm going to put a normal one about here. I'm going to put an accelerated one right here. Oh, they're not even connected. Fancy man. Our towers are low on ammo. Yeah, I noticed. More ammunition factories. Thank you. And here, basically going to come on. One of you. One of you. And then we're gonna take the pipe up a tad bit. Oh, that sucks. Put it up through here and sell you two. Not enough ammunition to operate defensive towers. What? You guys have power cables going out the wazoo. There we go. That's much better. All right, we can put two here. Fuck off. There we go. And there we go. Oh yeah. I actually forgot about these. Can't see that. Hmm. Should we just Yeah, I think I'm gonna do that. Honestly.
because it's not like the aliens are gonna magically just attack these. Right? There we go. Hmm. This is a predicament. Spread like this. And like this. Like this. We're basically good. I think. What? I actually managed to cut a connector. <clears throat> there we go. That's much better. Should I just sell these? Reach is offering me up. Yeah, screw it. I'll sell them. At this point, they're just in the way. There we go. Go with that. Nope. There we go. Then it can connect back here. Because I want heavy artillery towers on every single point here. There. Let's put one here. One of those here. Sure, why not? Why not? Hmm. There we go. Yeah, that's pretty good. We can place two more than we're just enough. Basically. Oh wait, the output is more than the input. Shit. So I have to actually take two out. Hmm. Ah, screw it. I'll just add more. I'll literally just add more. Fun fact, if they give a warning of a meteor shower, just run away. You can literally just stand, like, any place, because it spawns right on top of rigs. Evasive maneuvers, Mr. Riggs. And then you can just basically go back. That's just a quick tip I... <clears throat> Sorry, that's just a quick tip I managed to learn uh, while just playing Griffbreaker. It's insane. It's crazy. Let's see. There. One there. Then we should be good. We should be Gucci. We should be Gucci. There we go. Mm hmm. Perfect. And I think I'm gonna add a buffer right here. This is getting dangerously close to this thing. But I could just run a pipe through it here anyway. Yeah, that's actually not a bad idea. The rock rain is over. That was intense. You're telling me. And while we're at it. Our towers are low on ammo. For now. Build more ammunition factories. For now. Thank you, Riggs. I think it was this one, yeah. There we go. Give it some pizzazz. <laughs> Alright. Now. Now that that's done and dusted, that should be pretty good. Yeah. Let's see where we can add some better towers, honestly. Let's add a few more like better towers then we should be good then we should be set for the final fight which i'm not going to do in this video there we go am i fucking stuck what there we go that's better <laughs> i cannot upgrade those let's add some better defenses here Let's add a gravity accelerator here. EMP artillery. We can add one of those as well. One here. Because I know those other fuckers are going to be here anyway. And... Hmm. Plasma mortar. Yeah. Let's add a couple of you. 
Let's see, what else do we need? Add some rocket towers as well. We need the smaller arms as well, the smaller weapons. Because they're going to be really instrumental as well. Let's see. Where are my plasma towers at? Railguns? Oh, here they are. There we go. Yeah, add some of these as well. We have more than enough iron so far. There we go. There we go. Swarm missile towers. Do I have more of those? Now let's add a plasma mortar here as well. There we go. Looking swanky. Looking really good. So far, so good, yeah. Oh yeah, I need to add uh, mine layer towers. I keep forgetting. I honestly do. go. There we go. What are these gravity accelerators? Let's add some gear. Just for a little flare. We should be good. Is this a nuke launcher? Plasma mortar? Yeah, that begs the question. Those nuke launchers are going to pose a problem for later. Honestly. So... I suppose I could just remove them and replace them with something different, like these. I think I'm going to do that, then I'll just move the, the nuke missile towers somewhere else. Uh, plasma mortars. Where the fuck are the nukes that I've placed? Because they need an actual line of sight. They can't have anything obstructing them, otherwise the nuke will just go off, you know? It's the same as the ro the rocket launcher I use, the nuke launcher. So, I propose I put a plasma mortar in every one of their places. There we go. That should be pretty good. And for added defense, I can do this. Where are they? Little new launcher. Yeah. I could do that. That should be pretty good. Hell yeah. That looks amazing. Base is looking good so far. And while I'm at it, I can might as well do this. Up to here. Then directly into it. Yes, plasma is connected. Now we need super coolant. It needs an upkeep of how much super coolant? 50 a second. Say no more, fam. Say no more. That's the super coolant refinery. At level 2, it gives off 50 a second. Just in case, I'm building two of them. Because I want to be over prepared. I'd rather be over prepared than under prepared. By the way. Hmm. Let's see. Oh, it runs from cable to cable. Output, input. Hmm. Yeah. For just, just enough. Oh, okay. I've been an idiot. What else is new? There we go. Always connect them, then the pipes are always connected. Yeah, that's much better. Much, much better. <laughs> Things are coming along. Now I think the base is perfect. I think the last thing I'm going to do, but I'm going to do this off camera just to not waste time. I'm going to delete everything here just so that the enemies come to this area if they're going to come from this side. So this is just out of the way. All in all, we did good. We have a lot of each, except for Ferdinite, but I guess we kind of used a lot of them. Okay, and in case you guys haven't one, uh, noticed, I got myself a little dash for acid. That's really good. Got that one off camera. Sorry. <laughs> Perfect. Now all that's left are, are to build these, but I'm going to build them in the next video. Hell yeah. Ah, <laughs> oh, shit. 
anyway I think I'm gonna leave this video here we've did we've done a lot of good progress the base is looking amazing if I don't if I do say so myself I might add some synthesizers here and there but I don't actually need the resources we're doing good on resources except for crude uranium and normal uranium that's fine I can just add synthesizers to add either but we're doing good we're doing really really good <laughs> uh, next video is gonna be amazing we're gonna finish and we're gonna leave this planet all well looking like the place is tiled out for the Emperor himself it's gonna be amazing but yeah thank you all so much for watching this episode of Earthbreaker. breaker thank you for watching me prepare for the end game because this end game is gonna be incredible Thank you all so much for watching. I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day. Take care. Peace.